So I finally got the garage how I want it to be. So here's MR2. I got enough space over here to work. I got my wife's car finally pulled in for the winter. So, and over here there used to be a bunch of junk and I couldn't really fit anything. So now it's clear because these all this shelving is here now and it's it's like right above my head so I'm never going to hit it it's nice got some oil up there stuff I don't really use that much you know get stored up there and then got my bike and then I got some car stuff over here it's just car stuff that never really gets used but it's just big car stuff gas cans and oil change ramp um, I got all my wood over here for putting the car up on on it I have some I have the car up on some right now but didn't use all of it and all the bikes are all organized Got them up on the wall, and then I have my cherry picker over here, kind of out of the way, somewhere where I don't really, I don't need to access it, but it's still, it's still there if I need it. it used to be in a corner over here, and it was pretty hard to get to. So if we make our way over here, this is, this is kind of the, this is the big stuff. I got a door there. I got a couple fenders. For them are two. I got my main tool chest here. You know, I got my impact stuff, and then this is main stuff I use, little stuff. Um, and I got two engine stands over there. They're broken down right now, and all this stuff is kind of just thrown on here for now to get it out of the way. I can organize it. Got an air conditioner up there. That's when we used to have a house with no air, it, it, central air. And then I got this new shelf. This is what I just got. And the reason why I got this is because I wanted to put like parts that are new and y used parts. Kind of separate the parts from the, from the junk. Because this is all kind of just junk. And then this is like important stuff. So, you know, in these two crates I have um, a whole broken down... Um, engine parts in there and then there's just some of the bigger components like the intake manifold and the exhaust manifold and i got a block right there i got a crank right there there's the ac compressor and then this this bin right here this is all the rubber components anything rubber or plastic uh, goes in there uh, and then this whole rack right here is for tools so I can easily access them. The nice thing about this uh, is that it has the wood shelves so uh, things don't fall through it. This one has like wire and it's really strong but uh, shit falls through it and it's hard to put stuff on top if it's heavy like the block. I had to, I had to get a piece of wood and put it over there. So yeah, this little area, just enough space to put some stuff on it. And work on it and my wife can still pull in and uh yeah, anything else that i did oh yeah i did this got since i moved this big guy over i i'm able to fit a bigger workbench here and uh oh yeah able to fit a bigger workbench in and uh so this is just my lathe it's pretty rusty i haven't been taking care of it i pulled it out it was it was in this thing i just pulled it out but yeah now i got a nice little window i can look out of i got this big power strip that i can plug stuff into which is convenient uh, i used to have to either use that or use an extension cord or plug it into this mess up here stuff and then I have 
this thing over here, which, which is nice, but it's like high up and it's kind of annoying. So it's nice to have some plugs over here. And then I mounted my all my mini hardware. Anything that's pretty small goes in here. Yep. And then here's all my tools and stuff. I got got some other stuff in here. Like I got fluids. I got new oil for Yaris. Some pre-diluted coolant that I put together. And your acetone. You always got some acetone. Some more coolant. Got some distilled water. Got my red line. Here's my two impacts. Got to keep these safe. Keep them, uh, keep them hidden. You know, got to have a brake clean. I got three cans in here. This light. You know, some glue and some stuff, so... Yeah. Well, that's about it. There's the MR2. There it is. Your car is all safe now. And I can work. I got a lot of space to work with here. Still doing the suspension stuff. Kind of been dicking around with organization.